Hey everyone, Shaper1000 here today. Today, any day, whatever day I'm on. Today, uh, I just got an update on the doctor. I went to uh, went to talk to the surgeon today, so they're shooting for about two weeks from now. So, they want to schedule me. Well, they got to get clearance through my doctor, which they're the ones that sent me there, so that's not a problem. So, <clears throat> sometime next week the scheduler scheduler the person that schedules she's going to give me a call and let me know what day and then like a week before that i got to go have something done and make sure everything's fine and but i guess they're not going to do the operation they are going to put a stint in because they got a stint now that'll last 15 years well, that last 15 years, then that's going to put me about 70 years old. So, uh, you know, I'm okay with that. So, anyway, yeah, so it looks like a couple weeks. And then it'll be an overnight stay. I'll spend the night and then about a week of recovering. They don't want me to do anything, you know, really at all. Just, uh, you know, like no, no outside work, no sweating, no no nothing like that but yeah you know, they said maybe sit inside and make your youtube videos do some cooking videos or something so yeah i said well i can do that <clears throat> so yeah um but that's the update so as it gets closer i'll you know i'll update you further uh this guy looks like tom cruise man he walked in i said you're tom cruise <laughs> he said no, I'm not, but I've heard that before. I mean, this guy, if he was short, because this guy's kind of tall, if he was short, you would mistake him for Tom Cruise, man. A younger Tom Cruise, too. Pretty wild. So, as I find out more, I'll let you know more, but that's that's what happened today, so went in and got that done. Or talked to him, and so as long as my insurance, you know, um, clears it, then you know it it'll be a go they'll they'll set me up a date they're wanting to get it done in about two weeks so that's about it for now um the bike i have the exhaust pipe came in for it today oh yeah also the battery came in i put it in because i didn't film it because you know it's just putting in a battery but uh Yeah, it starts up good, so. So, yeah, once I get the pipe on there, these are just sitting on here. I didn't have them on the other day, but once I get the pipe on, hope I don't have to do a lot of modification. I may have to do a little bit, because nothing's ever, you know, perfect on when you get these things, but. And then I need to get two light bulbs for the headlights. Uh, they're $8 for two of them. So once I get them, I'll be about $10 below my budget of $100 of getting this thing ready to go. I got this piece for it. It's out back. I'll get it put on. And yeah, and then that, that thing will be, you know, clean the wheels and tires up a little bit. Wipe it down again. And then that thing will be... That thing will be ready to be sold. Then I can start on mine. When I say mine, I'm not talking about what I'm going to keep, but I'm going to start on my Coleman. It's like that one sitting over there. I will start on it. Um, I got pretty much everything for it, except I'll have to get a... What am I going to have to get? I'll have to get a... Shoot. I have to get a clutch for it, and which they're pretty cheap, and probably a sprocket, and probably a chain, because the chain I got I don't think is going to be long enough. But so you know I'm going to put I'm going to put a hundred dollar budget on it since it was free. So but 
I don't think I'll come anywhere close to putting a hundred dollars into that one because like I said a sprocket a clutch and a chain and I think that thing will be about ready to go um, I think it it may need a throttle cable I have that kind of stuff so but we'll see um, what engine I want to put on it and stuff like that but that'll be be our next project and then after that we'll get the old school going and then the last one will be the white fox now if somebody wants to make me an offer on both of them you know I'll entertain offers <laughs> but anyway yeah so that's what I did today um, yesterday I didn't do a whole lot just kind of walked around looking at my stuff to see what I want to do next I got a gasket coming in carburetor gasket for that one over there at one of Richards um, so JD's who whoever but anyway it's theirs and then that one will be ready to go for them they're gonna sell it so but um, and it should be ready to go I don't I don't think I'm gonna have to jet this thing because uh, somebody buys it they're gonna buy it for a kid and they'll probably want to screw that screw in but um, on the throttle so I think it'll be all right for them if I was going to keep it I would probably jet it but I think it's going to be just fine the way it is so yeah everything seems to be cool let's start it up one more time and then I'll let you guys go uh, I'll turn the screen around thing shuts it off but if you if you don't reset that by pushing it in it won't will not start this works I'll show you that well it did work it worked the other day might need some WD up in there but so I'll take a look at that Yeah, it worked the other day. I pulled it out and shut off. There's a little, all it does is hold a little switch in in there. And sometimes they, uh, sometimes they'll get sticky and stick in in the run position. But anyway, it did work. It worked the other day, so it's not going to be a big deal. It'll be a lot quieter too with the other exhaust on it, so it looks looks pretty similar, real close to it, so I think it's gonna be alright. I don't know, it looks like there might be a difference here on that straight piece, but we'll see. Alright guys. What the hell is that? thought I heard somebody scream okay guys that's it for today uh, I don't know maybe this weekend I might hang the hammock up in here what do you guys think I'm gonna hang the hammock up in here and do a camp out I think that's a pretty good idea <laughs> just go from this one here over to that one there sleep out here in the hammock cool Alright guys, Shea Bear the Myth the Man Legend, I'm gone for now. And uh hope everyone has a great weekend. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye. Take care everyone.